The New Market. It started as a short and merry race to add to the Flemington Autumn in 1874. Devised by Captain Frederick Standish, Chief of Police in Victoria, and the man credited with coming up with another little race called the Melbourne Cup. And over the next 150 years, the Newmarket Handicap has found its place as one of the best sprint contests anywhere in the world. It's too late, sunlight from the Newmarket. What... The honour roll features some of the absolute greats of the turf. Wakeful, Burnbra, Baguette. In the 90s, Shaftesbury Avenue, and Scalacci. Scalacci wins the magnificent treble. Set for the new market. Racing. The new millennium saw a Golden Slipper champion win in 2003. Belle de Jour from Schwarzier. Belle de Jour on the grandstand and Belle Esprit, they hit the line. Belle de Jour might have won it. And a year later, a horse that would go on to dominate the breeding industry. Exceed and Excel in front. Regimental girl, Titanic Jacker flying with the three year old wins. It Exceed and Excel first. In that magical decade, the champions just kept rolling. The $1,200 Wonder Horse Takeover Target was the people's favourite down the Flemington Strait in 2006 and then went on to win the King's Stand at Royal Ascot. The same path for Miss Andretti a year later. One name on the Newmarket Honour Roll stands above all others. The Mighty Mare Black Caviar. The year was 2011, and this was win number 10, on her way to an unbeaten 25 straight. Black Caviar by four Crystal Lily and beat it, but she is unparalleled. Black Caviar, perfect. In the history of the new market, only five horses have won it twice. Red Kirk Warrior, the latest in 2017 and 18, with a blistering finish, that had Flemington roaring. Red Kirk Warrior, 100 metres to go, lead by about a length and a half, and cuts away, Red Kirk Warrior, what a training effort. And last year, a Kiwi mare by the name of Rockin' Horse stunned our best sprinters by winning at 100 to one. Rockin' Horse won the new market. A few months later, she went on to beat Nature Strip in the Dali Sprint in Cup Week to prove this was no fluke. Rockin' Horse has won it. In Melbourne's magnificent autumn, Flemington and its straight-line dash for glory in the new market stands tall. What would Captain Standish think of his short and merry race now? It's sure come a long way.